occupied. Joshua! Joshua! Don't, Clive. It's too dangerous. Fuck. Hold on, Joshua. I'm coming! Joshua! I'm here, brother! Clive, he can't hear you. Joshua! They're heading for the heart. He'll be all right, Clive. He's a survivor. We're getting close. I don't care what it wants. Neither do I. These beasts... They're getting stronger. We can think about them later. Right now, there's only one thing we need to focus on. The heart. child you made with the Emperor. Why, Mother? Why did you betray us all? You have no right! <gasps> Answer him! We took you in, Savage. Show some respect for those who raised you! <gasps> Honorable Elwyn, always thinking of his precious homeland. But what worth is a homeland in a world beset by the Blight? Father did not seek to protect his country. He sought to protect his people! A leader's duty is not to protect his people. It is to protect the source of his sovereignty. The noble blood that runs in his family's veins. So long as this bloodline remains unbroken, what does it matter if a nation falls? One can always found another. Unlike him, I did my duty. I preserved my line. I bore a son of the noblest blood to whom the whole world might kneel. That is why I gave Rosaria to Sambrek, that I might join my line with the Lasages and birth a savior of this benighted land, blessed by both Bahamut and the Phoenix. You sold your country for a child. Why did he need another? You had Joshua. I had nothing. You were always your father's son, so very strong and bold and daring, and yet you failed to awaken. Would that Joshua had been granted a tenth of your strength? Oh! How the nobles laughed that Elwyn's firstborn was surely the son of a concubine, and my own, not long for this world. The shame of it! The shame of being slandered by one's inferiors! How could you ever know how that feels? It should have been you! Why didn't the Phoenix choose you? She was every waking moment was spent trying to shoulder the burden that you and the Phoenix and the Duchy foisted on him. That's why I became his shield. To help bear the weight. But what did you do? You betrayed your own blood and surrendered your son to his fate! Joshua, my darling boy. I never meant to hurt him. 
The soldier's orders were clear. He was to be spared. Why did you survive? When the only one I truly cared for died? What? Have you not looked out of the window? Joshua is here! The Phoenix lives on! He's battling Bahamut as we speak! <laughs> 